Hello everybody, my name is Contrice and welcome to my YouTube channel. Um, hopefully you can see me okay. I'm actually sitting outside on the porch. Um, it's such a beautiful sunny day and I just wanted to sit out here. And um, I wasn't planning on even doing a video today. Um, I was planning on doing this video tomorrow, but um, um, I heard this song. I've been hearing it constantly for like the last month or so and i heard it this past weekend and then i heard it this morning when i was in the shower and i was thinking uh, well let me go ahead and put this video out so the title of the video is no pain no gain um a lot of y'all might be too young for this but this is um the title of a song by betty wright um it's called no pain no gain and um, it's one of one of the verses in the song is in order to get something, you have to go through something. And um, I don't really agree with the premise of the total song in general, but I think that um, that verse really does speak to a lot when it comes to growth and success. Um, hopefully you guys can see me. OK. But um, you do. You have to go through stuff in order to get stuff um there's no easy road to success success is about climbing it's about going through hard times it's about um really putting in a lot of effort and um a lot of people who feel like you can take the easy road to get there it's, it just simply is not gonna happen it's not gonna happen um anything you get easy you'll probably lose easy. Anything you work hard for usually will be the things that you keep. Um, so like with working out, for example, I am really, really big on fitness and working out is very, very important to me. And so when I go to the gym and I'm lifting weights or putting in my reps and, and get my sets done and everything, um, it, it hurts. It's a lot of work, it hurts but you gain muscle from that you gain strength from that and life and success in relationships are very similar to working out um you have to put in that hard work in order to gain the strength and the muscle that comes from it um painful times push out beautiful things any woman that has had a baby understands that concept um, I'm a mom my son just turned 16 and um, those contractions whew, I tell you they are rough but after all the pain and the labor and the pushing and everything that you go through to have the baby it seems like as soon as you have your baby you forget about everything that um, all the pain and the suffering to get there because you you birth this beautiful thing and that is also with the things that you go through in life it it develops you and once you gain the prize um you almost forget about everything you went through because it was so worth it and um success if everyone was able to reach it more people would have it whether it be in business or relationships or whatever, um, there's a reason why marriages are about 50-50 because it's, it's hard work. And a lot of times, you know, other situations could cause for you to need to get a divorce, but a lot of people just don't want to put in the work that um, is necessary for you to have a successful relationship. And business as well, even doing a YouTube channel, you have to continue to be consistent and build and build. And it can be hard at times, um, especially in business. Um, I've owned a business um, for three years and that was some really hard work. It's very rewarding, but um, it's not easy. And that's why a lot of businesses fail a lot of times because they don't calculate the cost that you have to put into um, developing your business and being consistent and sticking in during the hard times. Um, that's why there are not as many successful businesses as people that start them. If you um, made it this far in the video, go ahead and hit that like button if you can for me, um, if you like the video. Um, but God takes us 
and allows us to go through things, hardships to gain from it. Um, like it says, all things um, work for our good, for the good of those that love the Lord. Um, a transparent moment for me, um, my husband actually deployed in um, August in the middle of a pandemic and um, it was short notice. So it was a really, really hard thing for me to even grasp my mind around at this time and to go through the last almost six months dealing with the pandemic um, with him being gone has had been one of the hardest things to do. But during that time, I was able to, um, God was able to get me alone and he wouldn't have been able to do that had my husband been here. So during that time, um, he actually used it to work on me and work on the things that he needed to work on with me, be it that he missed a lot of holidays, birthdays and stuff like that. Even my book release, um, I can look back on it now at the end and say um, that it was for my good. It was for his good, too, because he needed to, to um, get some school stuff done and everything and be able to focus and figure out what he wanted to do with retirement. So um, it all worked for our good. It was hard, super hard. Even yesterday, I was having a hard day because I um, had some electrical issues with the house, and it ended up being something simple. But um, it, God will take you through some things or, or allow some things to happen. And during it, you'll be like, man, why do I have to go through this? I'm, I'm doing right, and I'm, I'm trying to live right. But that's how he develops us. And that's how we go from greater to greater. He develops us in those hard times. That's how you gain your strength so that you can be there and have a story to tell for somebody else. So we have to go through these things. So if you're going through a hard time right now and you're trying to figure out why, or if you're in a business and it's hard, um, just know that on the other side of all of this is a story or um, a prize or the victory. You'll come out stronger. You'll be so much more blessed after. And you'll be so grateful that you went through it. And, and you can't see it now. And it might even be hard to see the path um, to better. But just stay in it. Ask God for strength. Um, just continue to stay prayed up. Try to stay as positive as you can and um, just continue to move forward. You can't stop. You got to keep going. That's my motto. You got to keep going. Um, so thank you for watching this video and I can't wait to see you next time. Have a good day.